Tearful Prince William spills guts as genuinely upset over Harry's concern in ITV documentary. It was reported that the Prince of Wales cried following the broadcast of the ITV documentary into Meghan and Harry's royal tour in Africa. William was genuinely upset to watch Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's concerns after they aired in the ITV documentary, Harry and Meghan, in African Journey. The 2019 show featured Meghan revealing that it is struggling and not really okay. In case you don't remember, things escalated in October of 2019 when ITV released a trailer for its documentary, Harry and Meghan, in African Journey. The Duchess of Sussex revealed that her friends warned her before marrying into the royal family that the British tabloids would ruin her life. Markle admitted that her first year as a royal was tough and that she had had no idea what was to come being part of the firm. When the trailer came out, William and Kate were on a tour of Pakistan, and the coverage of the interview inevitably overshadowed reporting of the last day of the Cambridge's tour. The Cambridge team was not happy and saw it as a deliberate attempt to knock the Cambridges out of the headlines. Relations between the two households became quite tense. Royal editor Rebecca English mentioned, I was told William watched the interview with Meghan from ITV as a result of noticing it on somebody else's TV. They weren't giving any particular preview of it. He watched it genuinely horrified and really actually upset and actually anxious about his brother. It was put out at the time that he was offended. However, that wasn't my understanding in any respect. Before concluding, she made a shocking revelation when adding how we always hear this narrative that William is tough and angry, but I've heard he basically cried over it. A diary editor says the episode highlights how the structure of the firm means that relations can easily become frayed. The book shows how difficult it is for a royal family to have normal family type relationships, he says, because everything you do is monitored, your diaries worked out, you've got people you have to tell, it's so it's really hard to pick up the phone or just go and meet your brother as a normal person would. Nevertheless, after Queen Elizabeth II's passing earlier this month, it appeared as though both Prince William and Prince Harry set aside their differences in order to attend the royal funeral proceedings and meet with mourners also grieving the loss of the late monarch. And although many are hoping this unfortunate situation might mend things between the brothers, it sounds like things may remain in limbo until Harry releases his highly anticipated memoir. There is still a serious amount of distrust in the air, and there hasn't been any cause for that to change. The feeling is very much that there is little point in pursuing a repair in relations until all the cards are on the table. It's such a shame to see their amazing bond turned out to be like this, Kate once shared in an interview. As quoted Princess Diana's biographer, Andrew Morton, their relationship is incredibly intimate. Nobody apart from each other knows exactly, not even their father, what's gone on in their heads and their hearts for the last 20 odd years. It was always the case that when Prince Harry married, he would have his own household and his own home. It is traditional that when you marry, you get your own place and have your own household with your own private security, equity, and other court functionaries. They're very, very close. They're also very competitive and always have been. The problem is that Prince William never expected Harry to become almost estranged from his family due to a woman. Royal family expert and author Katie Nichol has detailed explanations to why Prince William seems like the most disappointed royal at Prince Harry's actions. He always thought Harry would be his wingman. Now he's doing it on his own. Thank goodness he's got Kate by his side.